Hi, I'm David Libo. I'm a PhD student working on Game to Speech, a system that will provide audio description for games. Today we're gonna have a look at the first prototype of a Minecraft mod that will add audio description to this game. For doing such, I forget the Accessibility Plus Minecraft mod published by Chris Sanchez in 2020 and modify it. I added the notification system and the use of the Game to Speech API. Here we are in Visual Studio. We will not go in depth about the code, but we can notice here a send to server function that is sending data to the Game to Speech API. Now let's launch Minecraft with the Game to Speech mod installed. It can take a while. Here we are in the Minecraft world. The Game to Speech mod is adding commands. The one we want is the connect command. This command is asking for a login key. To get that, I will log in Game to Speech on a web browser and click on Create Login Key on my profile. Then I need to copy paste this key into Minecraft using the Connect command. Success! If I get back on the web dashboard and refresh it, we can see that I am connected to Minecraft. But when I go back to Minecraft, I still don't have audio description. That's normal. The audio description is provided on the web browser. We can see some OK on the Visual Studio console showing that API calls have been made. Now, if I go to apigamespeedcom slash listen slash David and go back to the game, we can hear audio description. Sand. Warped fence. Birch sign says, 1, hello, 2, Gamito speech, 3, world, 4, Carved pumpkin. Jack o' lantern. Carved pumpkin. Sand. Dark oak sign says, 1, yes, there is, 2, something, 3, written here, 4. I personally cannot read text on this sign because there are not enough contrasts, but the game to speech can read it. Sand. Spruce log. Boat log. Birch log. Jungle log. That's all for this demo. If you want to learn more, go to game2speech.com slash minecraft.